Assalamu alaikum warahmatullah. Did you ever hear the story of the man who thought he thanked God enough? It's a really interesting story that's related in the Musarrak of Al Hakim, and it's a story that Jibreel alayhi salam tells our Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wasallam. The story goes like this: that there was a man who worshipped Allah subhanahu wa taala continuously on a mountain on an island in the middle of the sea without any distractions and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala provided for him from the vegetation there so he had everything that he needed for and he just worshiped Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala continuously for 500 years and the angels would see him in sujood as they would descend and ascend and this man Worshipping Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in this state, Jibreel alayhi salam mentions that when he dies and is resurrected before Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, allow this servant to enter into Jannah by my mercy, by my compassion. And this servant says, Ya Rabb, bi amadi, O Allah, I want to enter into Jannah by my actions, by my good deeds. I worshipped you for 500 years non-stop. I want to enter into Jannah based on all this good that I've done. And so then Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala illustrates something profound for us. He says, weigh on the scales, on the one hand, place on the scales, the 500 years of good deeds that this man did, the 500 years of worship. And on the other hand, place just the gift of eyesight. And it will be found that the gift of eyesight is heavier in the scales than all of those 500 years of worship. In other words, worshiping Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for 500 years would not be enough to even thank Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala just for the gift of eyesight. What about all the other gifts that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has given us? And then he says, Ya Rabbi, let me enter into Jannah by your mercy because I didn't thank you as much as you deserved. At that point, Jibreel alayhi salam turns to the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi and he says, Ya Muhammad, innama al-ashya bi rahmatillahi ta'ala. O Muhammad, verily all things occur by the mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. How much is there, my dear brothers and sisters, in our lives that we take for granted? Ramadan reminds us of those blessings. Every little thing, our life, our health, our happiness, our, our family, the greatest gift of all is the gift of knowing Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, the gift of Iman, the gift of gratitude, the ability to thank Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make us amongst the thankful. Jazakallah khair.